John Hawkins. Here we go. The Jason Kincaid from West Virginia taking on Marco Corona. We're right here at Corona. Seems like he's coming back from a knee injury himself. We got Jason Kincaid. This man is such a talent. I don't know if you've ever seen him or not, Matt. This guy can really go, as you're seeing right now. This is the first time I've seen the gift Jason Kincaid go out in the ring. I've heard a lot of good things about him out of the West Virginia area, where he's from. Kincaid comes out of the SWA promotion in Huntington, and I tell you, he's been tearing things up up there for a while. Well, Jason Kincaid working over the arm of young Marco Corona here. We've seen Marco around a few times here in championship wrestling. Marco's been on the injured list, injuring his knee a few months back in Greenville, Tennessee. What a huge shoulder block. Just about threw Marco out of the ring. And Marco may be undersized, but this kid's got hard. And Marco Ooh. caught him. Oh, my. but my God. Kid K just tattooed his elbow right across his face. And he. Oh! oh. My God. That's what I like to see. My this guy God. means business. This guy means, I mean, look at this. Shake 100%. Face. I tell you what, I don't think I've ever seen that. And Marco may have a busted nose. Oh. And this young Marco kid is in trouble. One, two. Oh. And Marco Corona rolled his shoulder up in the last second. Well, if I was Marco Corona, I would have I would went straight back to Mexico on that one. Not to be cliche, but I think he just took his head off. <laughs> and he's gonna looks like he's gonna rear him back here. Well, Surf, maybe a surfboard? After, oh my goodness! After that injury, Marco hadn't been able to stretch very much, so it looks like he's getting a little help stretching out right here. My heavens! I've never seen nobody stretch like this. <laughs> well, the human body's not made for that, Matt. We just have to be lucky enough to get to see it. You got to be careful there. Both both shoulders seem to be uh, pins in a mat on that. Kid Kate up. Oh my God! Right across the knee. He's breaking this guy in half. He's teaching him what. He's, Kid Kate is making an impact. He's trying to show exactly what he's got. He's on national TV now. And wait a minute here. What's he going for? What in the world <laughs> is that? He's going to break this kid in half. We're going to see a spine come out of belly here in a second. Oh God. Look at him pull it the up the face. Might want to think about stopping this. Oh, my God. I think I have a new favorite wrestler. One, two, and Marco rolling that shoulder up. <laughs> How in the devil did he roll the shoulder up, John? Marco Corona's lost his mind. I mean, come on. This, if this doesn't call for a ref stoppage, I don't know what does. Well, I'll tell you what, I'd like to say hello right now to the wrestling fans watching us on the Marshall College Network in West in Huntington, West Virginia. Hello to you folks from Championship Wrestling. You're watching the gift Jason Kincaid take on Marco Corona. Oh, and Marco moves out of the way, folks. And young Marco Corona, that may be what he needed. His second win, he's going up to the top rope, and this kid can fly. What's he going for here? Musali misses. Oh my god. That's goodness. why they call it high risk. Because there is a risk to it, and he just paid the price. And he came with a sleek shot. Oh Lord. That's it. That's gotta be it. One, two, and three. What an impressive debut for Jason Kincaid. Jason Kincaid. Well, the gift Jason Kincaid, a proper name because this kid's got a gift, I believe. And that's the gift of a professional wrestler.